Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Andre Ali and in today's video I'm going to show you how to create the look that I'm wearing right now. It's a little copper moment. This whole look is done with Tarte products and I'm very happy to partner with Tarte Cosmetics to share with you some of their iconic products and some of my favorite products and also these customizable sets that they have now available. Throughout the whole video, I'm showing you everything that I'm using, how I'm using. I'm not just gonna talk about products, but I'm also going to explain to you how I've created this look as usual. Now let's get started. I'd like to start with the foundation and this time I'm going to use the Amazonian clay. My color is 27S, which is the light medium sand. All the foundations from Tarte right now, they come in the set where you get the price of the foundation, but they add extra stuff for you for the same price. For example, this foundation comes with three other minis. The same goes with most of the products that I'm gonna talk about. I'm gonna be fancy today and I'm gonna take my foundation from this little palette because I always put it directly on, on the back of my hand. Get me closer, please. This is that type of foundation that is full coverage and that, in my opinion, does not require primer because this is the type of foundation that will blur your pores. And like, it has that moussey texture to it, almost like a primer already. As you can see, when I spread it, it's like, whoa, covers everything. And with the coverage, you also have this blurring pores effect. The next thing I'm gonna do is contour my skin and I'll be using a much darker concealer. This is the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. The color I'm gonna use is rich, but I'll be making a little mixture. Just a drop of this concealer and then one drop of face oil. I've added the face oil because as you guys know, the concealer from Tarte is having a huge coverage. I wanted the product to be a little bit more sheer. And then with my foundation brush, blend it into the skin. And basically all I want is just to warm up the skin, but to really look like skin. And I said I am going to contour, but I was making a mistake. This is more of a bronzer for me. So that's why I applied it on top of my cheekbone. If there would be a contour, I would apply it more like right, right under the cheekbone. I was doing like a online session with one of my clients and uh, she put it very easily, very simple. She said, bronzer is on top of the cheekbone, contour is under. I'm like, yes, that's what it is. And then I'm gonna take the Shape Tape Concealer in light medium sand. I'll be extra and apply it on my little palette. Actually, this palette is really, really, helpful because I usually, what happens, I apply things on the back of my hand and then I'm like, I always mess up my hair. Not my clothes, but like my hair. This is light medium sand. And by the way, this concealer comes in in a set with a Shape Tape Glow Wand and with the Fake Awake pencil that I'm gonna show you both on how to use them. I always like to get the concealer, like what's, what's left on the brush on the brow bone, not so much on the mobile lid though. Next, I'm gonna take the Tarte Double Take Eyeliner. This has one side a pencil, a black pencil, and the other side is an eyeliner. I'm going to use the pencil side. Can you get me closer? Super close. I'm gonna get this in between the lashes. But I'm gonna take a pencil brush and smudge it. I'm gonna add a little bit more here at the outer corner. And with the same brush, spread it. When you have a dark, base like this, even if you use an eyeshadow on top of it, you will still have a little bit of that smoky effect. Then I'm gonna be using the Tartelette Toasted Palette. 
This comes in a set with a mascara. I'm actually going to mix these two colors right here and get it on top of what I've just built. And just keep on adding, keep on adding. Now the same color goes on the lower lash line. Now I took a little bit more of the darkest color in the, in the palette. And with my eyes open, I'm trying to sort of lift the eye a little bit by creating this shadow like from the corner of my eye towards the end of my eyebrow. And this is what gives this lifted eye effect. This is a great method to use if you have hooded eyelids or sleepy eyes like some people like to call it. And from this palette I'll mix this color with this color. They're both shimmery. I like them both, I couldn't decide which one I want to use, so I use them both. And the result is a very coppery eyeshadow. Check this out. I'm taking back that first eyeshadow brush that I've used just to make sure I blend the edges. Then I'm gonna take the eyeliner part of this double take eyeliner. Get a really, really close of the lashes. And then a little bit of that pencil right on top of it. So it's not as precise as the eyeliner is. And with the brush, I just make sure I blend. I'm going to apply a little bit of that darker eyeshadow, like the darkest in the palette, right here in the inner corners so that it has more like this feline effect. Now with this color right here, I am going to apply like on the bra bone, just so that these two eyeshadows right here blur like this. Then I'm gonna mix this color right here with this color right here and get it in the middle of the eyelid. Ooh, that's nice. It's not like they're eyeshadow, it's more like they're just metallic pigments. Next I'm going to be using the Man Eater mascara that goes actually in a set with the eyeshadow palette. A lot of you told me that you love this mascara. I've been using this in my stories and I didn't expect it to like this mascara, I'll be honest with you, just because of this brush. This is a very unusual brush for me, but it separates the lashes so well and it adds just the right amount of product on the lashes. Okay, I've added a little bit of mascara on the lower lashes and like I told you, I'm going to show you how to use the Fake Awake pencil. This is one of those pencils that you could use in a waterline just to give the illusion that your eyes are bigger and also to give you the illusion that you are rested. Because a lot of times we we have red eyes from, or like just tired eyes from not sleeping. And this really helps. Don't go crazy with it, okay? Because this is the type of pencil that will last. Usually pencils don't stay on the waterline. And when I first used this, I was like, this stays, okay? And like I said, this comes with in a set with the concealer and with the highlighter. So the highlighter I'm gonna use, it's called a Shape Tape Glow Wand. 
It looks like the shape tape. My color is a light. And listen, it's that very, very natural looking glow. That I recommend you to apply with your fingers. I love this color on the eyes. I just hope it's gonna look as good in the video. Maybe I'm gonna take care of that. I'll see when I add it. I'm not sure what color I should apply. Let's try this. This is the Maracuya Juicy Lip. And the color I wanna try first is Strawberry. This is so hydrating, but because it's more like a balm, if you press too much, it's gonna melt, okay? I suggest you to just do more like tapping motions. And this comes in different colors. You also have the clear version of it. Now, I feel like I need blush. I wasn't sure I, I was going to use blush, but now I, I know I will. I'm gonna be using this palette. This is really great. It's called uh, Tartist Pro Glow and Blush. You have a highlighter, a bronzer, and four different blushes. I think I'm gonna use this one right here. More in the center. I feel like it just makes me look a bit more, I don't know, youthful. Okay, now from the same palette, I think I'm gonna add just a touch of bronzer. With, the, with this makeup, I feel like it sort of disappeared. And this is it guys, this is my final look. I'm really impressed with this eyeshadow. I don't think I've ever used that combination of colors before. Let me know your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to use my code for a discount when you check out on tartcosmetics.com. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you Tarte Cosmetics for partnering with me in this video. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. <laughs>